Ryan, it, it looked like a, uh, a couple of the, the picks today uh, throws to Dez. I know you guys haven't had a lot of time together. Was that a situation maybe where there are some miscommunications on those, some some routes that were that were different? Yeah, I'm not going to get into the details of everything. Uh, at the end of the day, uh, it all falls squarely upon me, and I have to be better. Well, we just kept shooting ourselves in the foot, you know, uh, turnovers, turnover on downs. Um, we just penalties. We, we shot ourselves in the foot all day and, um, and we got to be better. And it starts with me. Apart from the, the route stuff, Ryan, and, and the first one in particular, were there any points there where they fooled you with the coverage or anything or they were giving you a look you didn't expect? No, no, there was no no fooling there. Um, just got to be better. At this point, I know you guys don't want to blame things on injuries, but I mean, the rate of injuries happening in, in games for you guys is, is, is at an alarming amount, um, especially on offense. I mean, how much does that hurt just in terms of you've got guys coming in, you guys, every single time? Well, obviously it hurts, you know. You you, uh, you want to have your, your guys out there that you're used to playing with and you got reps with. Um, but that's where we're at right now in the season. You know, it's been a been a tough season for us injury wise, and um, guys have stepped up and took advantage of some opportunities. And uh, there's some things we still have to to work through uh, with that. And um, you know, hopefully we can we can get our guys back, and then the guys that that are just starting to get reps, that so we can get more reps with them. What is the frustration level like, Ryan, when your turnovers coming, stopping yourselves on other drives, and how do you kind of fight through it, and how do you feel like you guys did with that today? The attitude was good, you know. I think the belief w was there. You know, we, we were moving the ball. The confidence was there. Um, we just felt like we just needed to, to get a score and, and we'd be rolling. And uh, like I said, we moved the ball consistently pretty much the whole day, except for a couple drives, and just kept shooting ourselves in the foot. You just have to play cleaner football, um, taking care of the football, starting with me, and then you know, clean up the details. You know where. Uh, penalties hurt us a couple situations. Short yardage situations uh, really hurt us where uh, you know we weren't able to convert those short yardage situations a couple times. So um, a lot of things to clean up and, and look forward to getting back to work. Did you say anything on the sideline at any point or, or in the huddle to the guys like about the pick? Yeah, I talked to the guys and uh, and they, they were good and they supported me and, and uh, you know, have my back through, through everything. Uh, but at the end of the day, I expect better of myself and, and need to be better for this team. For the most part, you've taken care of the football over the last few years, but this year, you know, interceptions are starting to pile up a bit. What is that, what is going wrong? What's behind just the, you know, the uptick and some of the turnovers? Yeah. It's a, a story for everyone, right? But it, at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter. You have to find a way to uh, take care of it and, and put the ball in the end zone. Is some of it uh, maybe trying to force things, trying to get a spark, trying to maybe make some things happen? Yeah, when we're, once we're down there late in the game, um, uh, especially the last one, just, uh, you know, we needed a score. We needed yards. Had the short route on the outside, but, uh, you know, we needed, we needed to move the ball and, and get, get more yards than, than a, a five-yard pass. So uh, got a little too aggressive there and, and tried to uh, – to make something happen, knowing that we needed two scores there with no timeouts late in the game. Ryan, you and, and Brable both mentioned the mistakes that killed the drive, but the tough opponent coming out and really the rest of the season, how crucial to get those mistakes. Yeah, no doubt. Have to uh, have to be able to to make the corrections and then turn the page and, and get ready to go again. Obviously, uh, going to a to a team that's playing really good ball right now, and uh, it'll be a good test for us. So, uh, I know I'm excited to to get back to work. Uh, I have a lot of belief in this team and this offense and, and what we can do. We just got to start shooting, shooting ourselves in the foot, you know, whatever, whichever which way. You know, we did it every which way today, and, and um, the good news is that those things are, are easy to clean up. So uh, we'll clean them up and be ready to go for next week. I know you guys have healthy respect for everybody, but you, you just beat six teams that have done really well. Two of your three losses have come against teams that haven't beat many teams yet, have any kind of – no, I mean, I don't, I don't think we were underestimating the team. I know I, I certainly wasn't. Um, you know, watch them on tape. They come out and they play hard. Uh, they have good, good players um, on defense. Um, 
you know, our, our energy was good, our urgency was good throughout the week. Uh, going into the game, you know, and pregame felt really good. Uh, just when it came down to it, we, we shot ourselves in the foot. Not that it's an excuse, Ryan, but it's it hard to imagine, uh, you know, the, the wide receivers like you came into camp with and started the season with and the number that have gone down, uh, you know, at this point, and, and you guys are playing with barely three healthy guys out there today. It makes it tough. It makes it tough, you know, playing, um, playing situations that uh, don't have a lot of reps with guys and, and um, causes some issues. So, uh, like I said, look forward to, to get more reps with those guys and then hopefully we get, get some guys back.